breaking news tonight. Two inmates are dead after yet another uprising at Tecumseh. News since six. The outbreak of violence was so bad the governor changed his schedule and immediately headed to the prison. Reporter Maya Signs is live in Johnson County about 70 miles from Omaha tonight with new information. Maya. Yep, Craig, Jen, two inmates from the prison were murdered during a disturbance earlier this afternoon in one of the Supermax housing facilities. Now, officials with the Nebraska Department of Correctional Services say 40 of the 128 inmates in that Supermax housing unit were involved in starting a fire in that unit around 1 this afternoon. The fire went out to the small fenced yard outside of that facility, and then the inmates refused to return to their cells for several hours. The prison's emergency response team went into the yard and burning area in full riot gear around 430. That's when all inmates were secured and the fire was put out. Any loss of life is tragic. The TSCI staff handled the situation extremely well, which limited the incident to a small number of participants and minimal damage with the exception of the loss of two lives. It took nearly three hours to contain the situation, which Governor Pete Ricketts says is a sign more staff and resources is needed to be invested in the prison. The people who, are, who were here today made a quick decision with regard to this incident, and because of their quick thinking, were able to prevent this incident from becoming bigger than it already was. The loss of life is tragic. But as I said, this is a dangerous place. Our men and women corrections do heroic work every day to keep us safe. And as long as the inmates here make bad decisions, we're going to have to respond to instances like these. The Nebraska State Patrol is on scene leading that criminal investigation tonight. Officials say the names of the injured and dead will not be released until next of kin is notified. Now, officials say the prison will remain on lockdown, on lockdown until further notice. Again, this is an ongoing investigation, and we will keep you updated online and on air. Reporting live, Maya Science, Came TV Action 3 News. Today's incident is the latest in a series of issues weighing down the Department of Corrections. A riot at the same prison in Tecumseh on Mother's Day in 2015 left two inmates dead, guards hurt, and a standoff that lasted hours. Governor Ricketts toured the facility right here following the chaos, giving KMTV access inside the prison and a look at all of the damage. There have been numerous assaults on staffers in the last two years. A prison budget hearing takes place this upcoming Monday in Lincoln. Manpower issues and working conditions are expected to be topics. In up